let's pack my valentine's day bag this is the bag that i'm going to be using i got it at tj maxx it's from aldo first thing that i need is a wallet i want to use a little wallet just because the bag isn't super big i think i'm going to use this adorable steve madden because i want to go with like a pink theme for valentine's day i want to use my gianna case because this little mama is my valentine's and i just love her with every being in my body i always need a backup charger so i'm going to use this pink one from iwalk to go with like the pink theme then i am going to use my pink beats again to go with the pink theme I definitely need a cosmetic bag for this purse because I don't like things to just be flailing around in my purse. I don't see any here that I like. For this shaped bag, I think the best type of pouch is going to be like this little flat type of pouch. I actually really like this one. This drawer is a little overstuffed. I feel like this one would be perfect, but there's a little bit too much going on with it. And then like the hearts, you know? So I think I'm gonna use this cutie little pink one. Okay, I have all of the main stuff. Now let's grab all of the little things to go inside of the pouches. It's Valentine's Day. Of course, I'm going to use my bougiest glosses. I also cannot live my life without a Summer Friday lip balm, so I'm going to pack this too. Nobody likes smelling like ass, so I'm going to pack my little Sol de Janeiro body spray. Really tiny, so I know it'll fit in the purse. And then to go with it, I'm going to pack my Sol de Janeiro hand cream. I do currently have lash extensions, so having a handheld mirror is necessary. I like this little cute pink Hello Kitty one. I'm going to skip tissue. I'm going to skip a brush. And I don't really need anything makeup related. Currently, I'm wearing my hair down, so I absolutely need a claw clip. This one is pink and it has hearts, so I'm going to pack this one. I'm going to skip on the hair tie and the scrunchie, but I am going to grab a backup spoolie because you can just never have too many of these laying around. I'm going to pray that my man wants to make out with me tonight, so I'm going to pack a couple of mints so that way my breath is nice and fresh for him. We're going out to dinner, so I'm going to pack some floss picks just in case I get anything that's stuck in my teeth after dinner. We're going out to dinner, so it's not going to be sunny. I don't need glasses, so therefore I don't need glasses cleaner. I do, however, I always want to be prepared in case I get a headache. I got these little containers from the dollar store, and I think they're so cute. I'm going to pack this little heart one, and I'm going to put I'm going to put some Tylenol and some Tums inside just in case. One thousand percent. I need hand sanitizer today. I think I'm gonna take a Bath and Body Works one. I'm gonna grab a pink one. Strawberry pound cake for the win. For my hand sanitizer, I'm gonna use this adorable pink and red cake one. Put a part two to watch me pack it.
All right, girls, let's pack a purse. I'm going to be packing this little cute $20 purse I got from Walmart. I added that little diamond chain. All right, let's pack it. The inside is like a baby pink. It's so cute. All right, I'll be taking this hand sanitizer. Champagne toast is in here, so I'm going to get the champagne toast hand cream. Portable charger. From here, I'm just going to take a cuticle oil pen. Some gum. Strawberry cream savers. Hand towels. Purse floss. This just has um, headache medicine. And I'm gonna take some lemons. You never know when you need this for drinks, fruit, food. And I'm also gonna bring this gum because I have to have gum. And I'm not gonna add any other purse accessories because I just like how it looks like that. Sir. I'm gonna take this little pouch and then this mirror brush duo. Okay, now just a few lip products. And there she is all packed up. I think she's so gorgeous. I might even go back and get the black version of this purse. All right, I actually made it a little bit better. I added glitter on the purse, if you can see. Let's pack my duffel for a 14-hour flight. Next is in-flight skincare. There's a lot of products, so I'm going to cool it on the editing for this one, so...
I know there's quite a bit of stuff in here, but for long haul flights, especially international, I like to just pack what I can in my like carry on or duffel in case my check in gets lost. Today, I'm going on a day trip. So let's pack my new Marc Jacobs tote bag. I'm gonna use this baby pink lululemon bag to put all of the little things in that way my bag stays nice and organized i definitely need tissues i have kind of a cold right now i'm not gonna be wearing any makeup today so i don't need neutrogena makeup wipes but i always love having wet ones in my purse because there are germs everywhere I'm going to pack two of these. And of course, I'm going to take my Mango Bloom supplements. I can drink this later while I'm in the car. I have a fear of not being able to stop coughing and like annoying the shit out of people that I'm with. So I'm going to take like three cough drops. I'm not going to take mints, but I am going to take a pack of gum. As far as medicine goes, I always like to carry Tylenol because there's nothing worse than being away from home and not having Tylenol when you need it. So I'm going to pack Tylenol, but instead of packing the whole bottle, I'm going to use this tiny container that already has some in. That's actually perfect. Put her back. I feel like I'm going to regret not packing Pepto-Bismol or Tums, but oh well. In this drawer, I have Tic Tacs, coin pouches. This is like a little miscellaneous drawer, which I am going to pack a pen. I'm going to pack eye drops because I just always need eye drops. Normally, I would carry this. It's for your debit card, like to get it out of the machine because I have long nails, but I'm going with my man. So if I need help, I can ask him. And then as far as my teeth go, I am going to pack this little thing of wisps because we are going to be gone all day and I like my teeth teeth to be clean and then i am also going to pack some floss picks normally i always pack some form of claw clip but i'm wearing my hair in a bun today so i don't need a claw clip and i don't need a hair tie because my hair is already in a hair tie i don't need a brush i am going to pack a mirror i'm gonna pack this little hello kitty one I love smelling good, so I'm going to pack my Sol de Janeiro body mist, and I'm going to pack the matching hand cream. The good thing about this cosmetic bag is it's pretty big, and the purse is pretty big itself too, so I can afford to pack both travel size of the spray and the lotion. This is my keychain drawer, which I'm not going to pack any today because I just don't need to. How cute is my Hello Kitty keychain drawer? I know this drawer looks very sparse, but it's because I haven't been buying candy. But for the trip, I do always like to have like some sort of comfort candy with me. So I'm going to pack these. I absolutely need to take a lip product with me. So I'm going to pack this one from Summer Fridays. I always have to carry a pair of scissors, preferably pink. I'm going to pack a lighter because what if I get stranded on the side of the road and I have no way to make a fire to keep myself warm? This will come in handy. In this drawer, I have facial mist, some stuff that's makeup related, and then this is kind of miscellaneous. I have perfume and deodorant. I am going to pack a deodorant. This one is sugar cookie because I just always get hot and I always sweat, but I always smell good. So there's that. In this drawer, I have my AirPod cases, headphones, and chargers. I always need to bring a charger because my phone's always dying. So I'm going to pack this really pretty pink one. And all of these are fully charged, ready to go. And then I always like to have a pair of headphones with me. So today I'm going to bring my pink Beats because I am using my pink bag. These are all of the small things I like to carry in my purse. Now let me put everything inside the cosmetic bag.
All of the little things are packed inside my bag, all nice and organized. Pack my purse with me using only things that I purchased from Ross. I'm gonna be doing a tote bag because I want to be able to carry anything and everything that I want, but I want everything inside of the bag to be pink. My Ross was pretty stocked. I got pretty much everything that I needed or that I want to carry in my purse, plus more. I got these really cute hello kitty socks i got some skincare i got some lashes pens a pouch makeup bags i got scissors because i do carry a full size pair of scissors in my purse because you just literally never know scrunchies this cute pink cosmetic bag first i'm gonna take off all of these little like plastic things i'm gonna take out all of the paper i'm gonna get everything out and ready to go and then we will pack it <laughs>
pack my backpack with me. My boyfriend bought me this Louis Vuitton Neverfull for Christmas. Never done a pack my bag with me with a designer purse. So let's pack my purse. The first thing that I need to pack is a wallet. This is the wallet that I have been using. I definitely want to use a different one. For the tote bag, I think I want to use a larger wallet just because there's real estate and I don't have to use a little wallet. I feel like the most practical answer for which wallet to use with this bag would be the matching wallet. Let me take everything out of this wallet and switch it in to this wallet. When you open this wallet, there's four card slots. And then over here, there's a zipper pocket. In this pocket, I'm going to put my personal debit card. And I'm going to put my business debit card like that. And then right here, I'm going to put my driver's license. And then in this pocket, I'm going to put mine and Gianna's medical cards like that. I don't currently have any cash, but I do have my Costco and my Sam's Club card. So I think I'm going to put those back here like that. I have two gift cards. I'm going to put the gift cards right here. And then if I had any cash, I would put the cash here. In my wallet, I'm not going to keep receipts or coupons because I feel like it just gets too messy. So I'm going to put these in a separate pouch. Okay, wallet is packed. Let me put away the old wallet. Receipts and coupons are gonna go in something I call a receipt pouch. I have three large ones here and then back here I put these little coach wristlets back here because these could be used as receipt pouches as well But because I'm using the white LV, I think it's only necessary to use this white LV Inside this little pouch, there's also this little side pouch. So I'm gonna put receipts on this side and then on this side, I'm going to put coupons. So in the future, if I have anything paper, like a photo, a ticket, a receipt, a parking pass, like literally anything, I'm going to put all the paper products in this pouch. That's going to help keep my bag so organized and clean. Receipt pouch is picked out. In front of the pouches, I do have two coin purses just because I don't want to put coins in either one of these wallets. I'm just picky like that. So for this purse, I'm going to use this cute little beaded coin purse that says, yeah. The next thing that I need for this purse is one big pouch to keep all of the little things in. I have really downsized on my cosmetic bags. I used to have like 300 and now I have like 20. For the tote, I think I want to use this baby pink Lululemon large cosmetic bag. Just kidding, I changed my mind. I actually want to use my LV cosmetic bag. And then because I know everything's not going to fit in this, I will also use this cute pink Christian Dior cosmetic bag. 
I'm literally loving the lineup. I might need one more cosmetic bag because I like to carry a lot of stuff with me. So maybe I could just pick one out just in case. I want something that's going to match the vibe. Ooh, okay. I'm either going to use this pink floral one. Oh, or this one. Okay, either this one as the third pouch or I'm going to use this one as the third pouch. What do you guys think? Now let's pack the little bags that go inside the big bag.
pack my new purse with me. Yes, I've already dirtied her up with makeup fingers. <laughs> Did I buy this Kate Spade purse weeks ago? Yes. Does it still have the tags on it? Yes. Literally fresh off of the shelves, silica gel packets and all, but I've just been procrastinating filling it, but let's pack her today because I'm thick of my little red purse. All right. Although I love to carry my whole life, my whole vanity with me, so it's kind of like, you know, a good size. It's kind of getting mom like milf vibes i don't know like oh, i don't know if i'm gonna be able to fill this it i feel like it's like bottomless like it's gonna fit so much all right first we're gonna start off with my vicky secret makeup bag not necessarily for just makeup i just like having a little bag to carry the little small stuff in my big ass purse so we're gonna take a um backup mascara we're gonna take a backup nars concealer it's this hoe is this hoe is literally empty but you know whatever if my pimples you know need a little dot and then obviously Advil. Duh, like I think I have endometriosis at this point. Um, and then some oil observing, ab observing, absorbing sheets in case I look like a grease ball one day. I'll look. And then we're gonna take some Benetint just in case I'm looking pale. Some Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer. Some hair ties. Don't forget your hair ties. Nail glue. Duh again. Um, Nyx lip liner. Da 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 some nail clippers this nail file cuticle thing whatever and then <laughs> a single dove milk chocolate now oh, it's time to start stuffing her like a thanksgiving turkey so yeah it has two sides and then this middle one i think i'm gonna put this in the middle okay today i'm so indecisive of where i put my stuff but i do know i want to put my pads and my panty liners in this zipper pocket right here i always put them in the zipper pocket oh i need to take that off bye oh by silica gel um yeah i'm putting them right there Ugh, i just thought of this imagine someone like wants to rob me in real life and they like they watch this video and they know exactly where my stuff is in my purse like where i'm gonna put my wallet if you see me in public and you do want to mug me i am going to be putting my red kate spade wallet with thousands of dollars in this middle zipper right here okay actually i feel like it'd be easier just to take it out on the side it's gonna be in the side guys taking some travel size baby wipes for my newborn if they're not for me they're actually for the baby that y'all said that i did have because apparently i am a mom now um so we're gonna put that with the pads on the side on the pad side Ooh, i'm excited about this look okay so i'm actually blind and i do wear glasses this is what they look like yep yeah. oh but yeah there is a little pocket right here and it fits the case like super perfect okay. and i'm putting this cute little wet brush right beside it in the other pocket okay next having a little mirror in your purse isn't unnecessary but this one specifically is because look like it's like 10x zoom like mm, i do not want to see myself dot zoomed in please please stop um a brand sent it to me. I don't know. I'm just gonna put it in the middle. I don't know why it's still lit up. Little Kleenex is going in with the period stuff. Your old out toys and uh, strawberry icebreakers going in next to my wallet. Period. I'm about to put the rest of my cosmetics like next to the makeup bag. So, Rare Beauty hand cream that looks like a pee pee hole. Oh! Um. And then I'm going to take like three different fragrances because I want to smell like something different like every day. I don't know. I'm just indecisive. So um, this is my signature Tease Cream Cloud from Victoria's Secret. Sol de Janeiro 68. And the Kiali Vanilla Perfume. Oh, so good. And then obviously some spray deodorant. Travel size. You always need that just in case you forget. And then um, this Batiste Dry Shampoo. I couldn't think of the name. And then this Vaseline all over body balm. I love this stuff. It's just like versatile. I can just whip her out for my lips or like, you know, where I'm looking dry, knuckles, titties. No, <laughs> but not in there. And then for the pedophiles that try to try me in the parking lots, um, I'm taking pepper gel and pepper spray. I gotta put them in a place where I can get them to them easily. So I think I'm gonna put them with my little brush in the little pocket yeah making sure i actually put a pen in here i always forget and then when you need it the most you never have one so pen right there i don't want to carry this my selena gomez raw beauty aroma therapy pen just in case i have a panic attack now this is that's not gonna help it but sour candy though actually does help if you feel like you're gonna have an anxiety attack panic attack when you're out um because the sourness just kind of takes your mind off of it and you just like focus on the sensations in your mouth i need to get i need to get some sour candy to carry with me but 
oh shit, I was gonna carry summer Fridays and this Fenty heat clear gloss. It's not clear anymore. Um, in this little pouch. I think that's it. I think that's it. I don't reveal. She looks thick. Ooh. Okay, so this is this side. I feel like I have a lot on this side compared to the other one. This is what the middle looks like, all my cosmetics and stuff like that. And then this just like has, you know, like the wipes and the tissues and pads and stuff. Um, I love her. This is a Kate Spade. If anyone was wondering, what is it called? Medium triple compartment shoe pebbled leather black Leela. The Leela. I don't know, but I love her. Bye, I love you guys. Let's pack my new purse. This is a new version of the Steve Madden bags that were viral last year. I personally love this shape of bag because it holds so much, but yet it's still so compact. My purse essentials typically don't change unless I'm switching out my wallet or cosmetic bag. Now I do carry a lot, but you just never know what situation you may end up in or if a friend needs something, I'm usually that person that has anything you need. One thing I will change daily is whatever lip combo I'm wearing, I'll carry that around with me. But if I could only bring three things, number one would definitely be a just-in-case pair of contacts because I cannot see without that. Second would be a portable charger. I can never not have my phone for safety purposes mostly. And third thing is some sort of mint or a little candy just in case. Another thing I usually have is a reusable bag. This one is a strawberry that folds up into itself. Some hand sanitizer and tissues are a must. This little bag holds so much and let me know in the comments what are some of your purse essentials. I got a new one for the occasion, so let's go. And of course, as always, if you want to shop anything from these videos, everything will be in my Amazon storefront, including this adorable new fossil bag. Oh my God, I am obsessed with this. Now, of course, first things first here, number one rule, we got to drop in our Cyber Kugel bag ball. Drop it right in. By the way, if you've never seen a Cyber Kugel bag ball before, these things are phenomenal. They actually roll around the bottom of your purse, collecting all the lint and nasty stuff that like nobody wants in their purse. And then when it gets gross, you just bust the cage off, wash it, and reuse it. Anyways, moving on here, I want a couple options for gum, so I'm going to grab a large pole of rice. And I'm even thinking a classic bubble, because why not? I want a couple Tic Tac Travels, too, because I cannot with how cute these are. Okay, survey says, what do we get? Ooh, I think that looks good. Oh my god, literally the perfect variety. Yes, queen. Alright, next up we're moving on to the anti-germy goodness. And of course you know we gotta get a Touchland hand sanitizer. Now, Berry Bliss is one of my favorite scents, but I think I want to go with Appalicious because I've never smelled this one before. Hey, you know what? While I'm here, I'm going to grab a couple of these little hand pop disinfectants. You can use them for hand and face. Just a good little poppable convenient towelette. 
Next up, baby, you know we're doing a fully loaded purse today because we're going to grab us a Lysol and a couple wet ones wipes. That's right, baby. We ain't playing around this season. Also, say it with me. What's the rule? We always grab toilet seat covers. And you know why? Because y'all, some bitches really be out here in the year of our Lord 2023 with an unwashed ass, okay? And we just can't risk it. You know what? While I'm in here, I want to grab a little lip balm. I'm kind of torn, though. Do I want a Carmex or a Dionys? Hmm. Okay, wait a second. Hold on. Ain't nobody telling me what to do. I can have both. So first up, Dionys Coconut Cream. For the Carmex, I'm actually going to grab the Cool Mint just because I'm super curious. But honestly, all of these look phenomenal. But also, while we're on the topic, tell me that is not the cutest damn Carmex you've ever seen. Come on now. Just so damn adorable. All right, next up out of face and skincare, I don't need too much here. I'm just going to grab a few makeup removers because I always like to have these on hand. And for the face, we're grabbing two different kinds, and then we're also going to grab some eyelid wipes. All right, next drawer, super quick. We're just going to pop in real quick, grab ourselves a little Puffs Plus with lotion. Also known as the superior snot rag, and girl, don't make me fight you. Ooh, sneak peek, y'all. Next up, it's time for lotions and smell goods. But honey, you're going to have to come back for that because I've already talked enough, okay? So go to part two. Actually, scratch that. Make sure you follow, like, and comment a ton, then go to part two. <laughs> Love you, sexies. Mwah.